ultimate goal is to become a law enforcement officer. Um, and so I thought the cadet program would be a good opportunity to get my feet wet. Um, but if you come in with an open mind and you're ready to learn and you're ready to see what it's like, I for sure would do it. But it's definitely given me a different outlook on the law enforcement community and um, felt more, I felt more um, a part of the community now. So. I was 17 years old and my mom just kind of signed me and my brother up um, just because she thought that the discipline would be good for us and we've always been really involved in like sports and school so she figured why not keep us busy and San Mateo PD was a great place to be. A lot of our uh, advisors and our coordinators are uh, sworn police officers and uh, they help us a lot with a lot of training pertaining to law enforcement. So we do uh, train for traffic stops, um, we go to the shooting range and uh, train with firearms. Um, we also do stuff like cost negotiation where we uh, try to talk a subject down um, and stuff like that. We have canine demos. I knew their job was obviously tough and difficult, but um, until I was on the inside, I didn't know exactly how difficult it was. Um, I didn't realize how much paperwork an officer had to deal with and like what they had to go through on a day to day. Um, I thought it was just easy of like arresting somebody and moving on with the day and on to the next. I'm definitely more vocal than I've ever been. Um, I'm more confident in myself. Um, yeah, I think I grew a lot more confidence than I thought that I would ever get. That was a great experience. I've always liked um, tactics and um, seeing how officers work together in, um, in cohesion with each other to either clear a room or just to achieve a goal, um, which is really what you do in life. Even if you're not in law enforcement, in other careers, you work with other people and you all come together to achieve one goal. <laughs>